enough practice with this one character, especially because I have a top player of the character in region. This, this can be overcome. Exactly. And um, Chase Me versus Elegant, actually. Elegant's training partner is a hero main, actually. Mm. So the hero player is named Lamp. They're, they're all, like, in this crew called MTM back yes. in the IE. And Homie plays with them a lot. So he knows the hero matchup. He knows how hero works. He knows what the game plan of hero is, the frame data especially. So I feel like he's going to be very, very comfortable in this matchup. He knows that Hero, after a while of, you know, getting in, Hero actually can't do anything. However, staying at that mid-range, it's super, super hard to get in. Think of the Kazap as Richter's forward tilt. And because Elegant works with that move a lot, in a lot of different various ways, he knows how to play against that. Yeah, Elegant, one of those players that definitely has his eyes set on the uh, summit spot up for grab in two weeks' time. So thinking about this as many different matchups as possible, just showing all of himself and then plugging as many of holes in his game plan as possible before that happens. So that's when it counts. But let's iron out the kinks in my Luigi. Have I been playing too much online? Let's get that online, offline practice, excuse me, down before that. Nah, he... He loves playing offline 10 million times more. He Every single time I see a tweet, he's just like, dude, I could react. Homie, yes. this is dope. <laughs> but getting into this, Elegant versus Chase Me, and both characters, you know, opting for Battlefield, this is not a stage that you would really see for a neutral start. This is usually like a counter pick for a sword type of character. Because I'm coming into there, acting, acting a lot like Richter's Whip, and what do you think about this matchup? It's not something you see every day because particularly, you know, these are two characters with their own game plans. Typically, you don't see more than one or two representatives of them in every region. SoCal, a bit of an exception with Luigi at least. But that being said, Elegant does know this matchup well. And I don't think he'll have too much trouble. As you mentioned, that experience with Lamp is going to be invaluable. Yeah, exactly. You could already see 137%. He doesn't need to go for the zero to this at all just because right after the hero does get in the disadvantage state, he can't really do anything. Hero doesn't really have a good get off from me option. His up B out of shield doesn't really lead into anything because Luigi could beat that out with either Cyclone or Nair to make his combo his own. And, you know, a lot of the times when Luigi quote unquote drops his combo to go for an 80% combo instead of a zero to death, Hero actually can't do anything about that. He just, ha like, and Elgin as a player, he doesn't like to go for the zero to deaths as, as much as the other Luigi's like Venus. He likes to go for the higher damage you know, down throw confirms. Yeah, Hero does technically have a sword, but the fact that so many of his aerials have enough end lag, that'll give Elegant the onus to say, okay, I have time to go for landing there. Ooh, and fantastic tech! Dude, that was that was insane, actually. Both both players miss, uh, messing up just a little bit, but it's all right. Oof, still doing a bit of work for Chase Me. I feel like... Again, Chase Me is always going to be stuck in shield right now just because Elegant knows how to play around. He knows how to throw out moves when they're plus against, in particular, Hero. And all Hero, Hero's game plan is, oh, I need to get certain spells. I need to set up with my side B. And then I need to get a F smash or an up smash right after the up B on the stage. There's the grab. Doesn't find that landing aerial, but still 39%. That's going to even the stocks. Ooh, Chase Me actually proving me wrong right now. Still keeping up with Elegant really, really well. Ooh, go off oh. for the bounce. Um, but, you know, Nair up B. That was really sick coming out from both players. Just because even though Chase Me was down the whole game, he was able to keep it respectable. He was able to say, okay, if you mess up, like, twice, I that could end up leading me to win. Just because vice versa... When Luigi is in disadvantage, Hero is able to just instantly side B on reaction. He's able to get any of his moves out. If he's able, even able to get a Flame Slash, that thing is like frame three. It basically comes out instantly. Yeah, Chase Me did a good job of landing moves, but when you're just allowing Elegant to get that many landing nares, there's just only so much you can do. But that's the thing. What could Hero do against those landing nares? He really doesn't have an out-of-shield option. But 
Having bounce makes it a lot easier. It takes out Luigi's uh, Zare and his neutral B uh, out of the equation. Opting to go for the Flame Slash too, again, super, super fast and, you know, really good double jump uh, double jump there. Yeah, just made use of Accelerado there, had the opportunity to go off pretty safely, and even if he missed at that high up, still drift back and take stage control. Yeah, but this is what I really mean. This this matchup is very volatile, just because right after one of these characters gets an opening, they really have to keep that advantage state all the way until death, or else, you know, they're going to let the other character do that a lot better. Not be useful in the menu there. Does go above the ledge. Elegant, well tuned to that. Doesn't go for the zoom. Ooh, I'm, sur I'm surprised Chase Me didn't opt to go for the zoom and tried to always try to upbeat just because, you know, Hero's recovery is very, very linear at that point. And Accelerado just keeping up and keeping Luigi in uh, in disadvantage. Back here again. Kaboom. Oh, and the misfire. Ooh, wait, was that a uh, ledge cancel, baby? <laughs> I didn't know he had those. Fair. Still has some Accelerado to play with. Ooh, honestly, Chase Me could really kill with a uh, with an F2. I haven't really been seeing that all too much, but again, it's a really slow move. It does kill. Up throw does kill also, so, you know, Elgin's going to try to watch out for that. Already two with grabs. Yeah, especially the psych up. Goes for the up tilt instead. Good mix up. But yeah, up throw, a really good kill option for Hero if he has psych up or both oomph and psych up. It kills super, super early. Both players trying to do as much damage as possible. Um, or, sorry, Chase is trying to do as much damage as possible for this last stock or for his second stock. Looks like and and that's gonna it. be it, yep. Because that, because that's why, you know. Ooh, this is this is really intense right now because this opening could really, you know, set the pace for the whole game. Elgin getting the nair jab, and right out, right out of shield. See, uh, hero can't really do anything. He was able to just fall down though. That's news. Ooh. Ooh, fantastic back here coming out, trying to go for another for other options. I really want to see the yeah the uh, side B, the neutral B, and especially the forward tilt come out a lot more just to keep Elegant off stage a little bit more. Yeah, Chase Me just hasn't gotten that kaboom at ledge that he's been looking for. Has the oomph, and that's gonna be it. Fantastic run under up tilt. Yeah, very well done from Chase Me. That time controlled the game from the start to finish. He got the stock lead and didn't have to play from behind. He just played a stocked up, never relinquished it, rather than having to make a comeback, which is difficult against Luigi because, he, again, you're playing that whole time. Don't let him get any of these two or three combo starters. I would say that if you have a lead against Luigi, you can play extremely comfortable because Luigi has to be the one approaching you, and because he doesn't have that great of approach options or aerial speed, it's really easy to play against. However, if you are down against Luigi and you have to make plays and you have to go in, you're going to get pivot grab. You're going to get hit up. You're going to get, you know, kind of destroyed. <laughs> but getting into this PS2, what do you think about this counter pick? I don't know what particularly to think because especially Hero is one of those characters that can make use of different parts of different stages just because he has so many options to be his spells at his disposal. That being said, as far as an anti-Luigi stage, have to see what he has in mind. No, like, Ele Elegant chose the stage. Oh, that's that's right. Um, Ooh, look at that tech, though. Uh, but it's it's going by really well so far. Honestly, I feel like Elegant chose the stage because these platforms aren't going to be really much of a hindrance as it was last game. Luigi, uh, Luigi slash Elegant had really hard time trying to get back on stage, right? Mm -hmm. So by minimizing as much platform as possible, oh yeah, you get you know a lot more of a fair game. But these two platforms give Luigi a you know earlier down throw into up B kill. Great tech chase with that F smash. Chase me down the first stop. Honestly, Elegant was actually chasing down chase me. <laughs> Ooh, and overextending a little bit too hard and eats a back air for it. 
Another tech roll out. This time, Elegant just onto him. You know, honestly, both creators are playing really well right now. Again, Chase Me finally getting an opening with the with an up tilt and actually getting Accelerado. This is where he really needs to make his opening. These full hop areas playing really well, trying to get out of Luigi's range, trying to dash check him. And it's so hard to whiff punish if once Hero does have that Accelerado. Gets it again, too. Up tilt has him in the air. Back there again, percent's almost even. And that's actually such a good option just to get back on the stage. Luigi really can't make up that much distance, so a uh, air dodge onto the stage is really good. The jab coming out, but anything from Chase Me will actually kill Elegant, but unfortunately couldn't get the zoom. Yeah, just didn't have any mana left, and by the time he was zoom fishing, only had time to go through the menu once. Is this it? Ooh, no, he opts for the uh, more damage, the 80% damage combo. Feeling a little bit of it off, but he's gonna get the grab as a punishment. Ooh, that's gonna be it. That's really that's a really good read, but ooh, actually no, I'm wrong. Boom psych up, anything could do it at that point. Tries to go for the tries to go for the zoom, but unfortunately, you know what? Rubbing salt in an open room. Fantastic job 